city of Dayton also working on plans of its own for a permanent memorial. A nonprofit here in Dayton is already putting together what they hope will be a memorial for generations to come. Two News reporter Judith Ratana is live in the Oregon District with how you can be a part of it. Well, just a few days ago, thousands of people crowded this intersection here for Dave Chappelle's benefit show. But at the same time, on the other end of Fifth Street, the community was coming together to create a memorial to honor the victims of this August 4th tragedy. Each tile hand cut, each one with the message, whether visible on top or hidden underneath, from a Daytonian. It has been a humbling and even spiritual experience. McMillan founded the Mosaic Institute. McMillan says the city called on them to guide a community art project at Gem City Shine. We wanted the dubs to be finished so the community could touch them and really connect with them. The nine dubs were inspired by the nine release at a vigil in the Oregon district, representing the nine victims. The hands at the base are the community. It also signifies, you know, how we are releasing our, our feelings and prayers. Designing a piece like this would normally take three to four weeks. To prepare for the Dave Chappelle benefit concert, the Mosaic Institute designed this in four days. We put a lot of positive energy and love into to this piece to try to get it ready for our community. The hope is for the mosaic to be installed on the sidewalk in the Oregon district. The victim's children can come back to the site in 50 years and touch these doves uh, and connect. McMillan says the best part is Daytonians themselves are putting the pieces together. It is a, a physical representation of the community coming together in love and healing to signify our hope. you want to help complete this mosaic, you can help by going to the Contemporary of Dayton next Friday for First Fridays from 5 to 10. They'll have the mosaic out as well as all the tiles uh, for you to come out and write your message or your prayer on this. Um, and it'll be part of that mosaic. It's going to hopefully be going here on the sidewalk, so it'll be there for generations to come. We're now live in the Oregon District. Judith Hartana, 5 on 2.